I'm Crystal. It's two days after my therapy session at Pender House with Joe Regina. Am I feeling better? No, I'm feeling decidedly worse. She told me that the consultation was confidential. Already I think that's lies. Um, I think every word was he heard what was said in the interview and passed on. It was written down on a notepad like the police used to do when they used to come round when I reported a crime, i.e. being punched in the face in the phone box. I don't think it was taken seriously, I don't think it's been dealt with properly and I think I've been left for six to eight weeks with severe depression and um, flashbacks and all sorts of nasty behaviour that's escalated. I don't think that she was properly qualified to deal with what I told her and I think it's been treated like a bag of rubbish. Uh, yesterday David came round. David is indeed my son. Um, he came round to tell me um, would I like to go out to the town centre with him. Um, I waited in for that sandwich. It didn't come. I'll tell you what, you, what happened with that sandwich. I didn't order enough. Uh, £3.95 was not enough uh, to be delivered. Um, and I didn't have access to Wi-Fi. They had my phone number, they didn't tell me. David told me that there was a meal deal in Boots uh, Chatham in the Pentagon Centre. So we went there together and I bought David a meal deal as well as myself. Um, he looked hungry, I was hungry, I bought him a meal deal and I bought myself a meal deal which included some sushi, you get a, a, a main dinner which is a pasta dish or some sushi or a sandwich. You get a snack which is crisps, a chocolate bar, whatever you like, and a drink. And I got this naked blue machine drink. I queued up in the queue next to the oral B toothpaste and two brushes. And I paid by my debit card. Mine, Crystal Marshall's debit card, not David's. Um, I felt shitty, terrible, um, I was wearing my black Mac, it doesn't have a hood, so when it rains I haven't got a hood on my coat. Um, I had the bun in my hair like I have now, um, my hair isn't long, it doesn't go down my back, it goes just down here to my neck and I wear red lipstick A because I like it, B because I want to and if no one else doesn't like it they can stick it up their bottom. Um, um, it's a Friday um, and um, there's not much to do on a Friday. I expect David may come round. He's borrowed my phone. Um, he's got my Samsung Galaxy 2 tablet which he's promised to bring me back and to bring the phone back in a decent condition. I've had messages to my phone this morning, one from my ex-husband, Dave, um, hi how are you and how have things been Dave, so I keep in contact with my ex-husband, I do indeed have somebody that I can give feedback to on my day and how people have been treating me. Okay, well, make sure you look after yourself. I expect you will get a dinner when you see them, which will be nice. I was telling him about going to my parents on Sunday. And he's asked about the housing. MHS Homes getting in contact with me to take me off his tenancy agreement. It should have been done about 10 years ago, but obviously hasn't. So he's going to see if they can send me some paperwork so I can go into MHS Homes Leviathan Way and sort that out and sign papers to say that I was Janestra Starawicki. I am now Crystal Marshall and that I don't live in Gloucester anymore. Uh, which has been settled over the phone and everything else and it's been settled because I have a tenancy agreement here at Lansdowne Court. So any fraud has not been committed on my part. I'm totally innocent of anything anybody else has done. Um, it's raining outside, it's cold, um, I don't feel like going out but you have to when you feel depressed to get your dinner, to get the milk, to get basic needs to eat. Uh, I feel that 
I'm taking the piss out of that I'm some it, it it's funny to make me angry there's a motorcycle parked outside I, ca I don't have a motorcycle license I can't drive a car it's a facade it goes on every day and I'm sick and tired of it it's peeing down with rain out there after my husband um, texted me um, I had an idiot ring, uh, message me on the phone. It's quite abnormal and not normal at all. And when someone says, text me now, in great big letters, I don't do that. Um, I'm sorry, Jenny, text me back now. I told them to go away because they were bombarding my phone with text messages and ordering me about, and I'm not taking anything back they can stay away and keep away they're annoying me and being a nuisance um, I'm just waiting for the post I'm waiting for my son David to return my phone I'm not happy I'm not happy with the way I'm being treated I believe that counselling consultation was not confidential at all um, because I was laughed at yesterday in the town centre and it extremely wasn't funny at all but I kept my head, her head up high and I walked past it. Depression is not funny. Being made a fool of isn't funny and I hope people will start to realise that I'm going to start to be taken seriously or I'm not going to play ball.